So knowing what you know now, 17 years into the game, um, okay, what are the three or four things you would like to impart to the young gallery owner or to the young... Collector. Entrepreneur. Oh, yeah, entrepreneur. Okay. To the young female entrepreneur. <laughs> no, stop! Can you not stop using this gender business, please? Good, I'm glad you said that. No, it's I think not about so that. It's definitely... This gender thing, exactly, but, so yeah. stop. Good. <laughs> uh, I'm so glad you said that because yes. there's, there's all this huge women's it's just movement. entrepreneur forget about female or male good okay? just I'm glad at least you are one of the few people that are, are not fixated all this gender diversity things bullshit man you know what I mean exactly. just, if you just if you believe if in what you yes. do just go for it yes. okay? okay and um, stick by that but I suppose um, number one we say four there are quite a few you know? number, yeah. let me think number just one what reel them all off I would say perhaps um, have conviction in what you're doing and what you're selling and what you're promoting, because you've got to stand by what you're. I mean, from, you know what you what you are pushing out there. Yeah. Okay. In my inst in this instance for us, it's like I have complete conviction in the artists that I work with and I've okay. been promoting and. How do I have the conviction? I collect the work myself. I'm not going to tell you to yeah. go and buy something and I'm like, oh, I won't touch it yeah. with a barge pole. You know, I mean, yeah. it doesn't work that Don't way. Don't be like Goldman Sachs, right? <laughs> yeah. Okay, so back the horse you're pushing. Yeah, number absolutely. Two. Number one, that's oh. that's no, that's very clear because that's what's going to push you, you know, for, push you forward. Right? Okay. Um, number two, um, I think work with. Um, Work with people who are on the same page as you, like who want the same things, who yeah. believe in the same things, right? I mean, in terms of professionalism, in terms of the way they want, you know, what, what are the things they want to achieve, that sort of thing. And everyone, I think everyone, because everyone has a role to play, yeah. right? So in, for us, I work with artists whom I know are committed to their work. Right, so I don't go and tell them how to do their business or how to make their paintings or their works or their art, and they don't come and tell me how to run my gallery. Okay. 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 So really, work, work, with, work with people, work professional people who are all in the same. You know, you're on the same page. You know, who, everyone has a role to play. Yeah. Um, number three. Um, God, something just came to my mind. Now it's gone. <laughs> a lot of things. Let me tell you. Um, comfort zone okay get out of the there. minute everything gets too easy start thinking about where you're going with it so you're thinking like an artist again because Absolutely. you don't want to be producing the same series exactly. of exactly yeah. so when i started my gallery yeah we were sticking paintings on the wall and selling them that's what we yeah. were doing but from there we went on to we started publishing art books and catalogues and for artists commissioning people to write for them, hiring curators to curate the shows. So today, I think we are probably the largest um, publisher of art books. And we've got over 100, 100 titles yeah. to our name. And Because over the years, I mean, yeah. we didn't think anything of it, but over the years, it's just accumulated. Then, and, so you can re it's reference it. a revenue it. stream as well, yeah? Well, I wouldn't say that the printing is a revenue stream, but I think more than anything else, the, it's good for the Malaysian art scene because at least there's some reference point, there are some re reference points, That's like right. books and things that you can refer to. Yeah. Okay, so... Um, Evolve so, or perish? Yeah, well, that the books, and then we yeah. we went, we took, we were the first gallery to take Malaysian art into an international arena because that was something that we really wanted to do. Okay, so and because we believed enough in our artists, we pushed them forward to international art fairs, New York, Hong Kong, Indonesia, China, Seoul, Korea, fantastic. wherever. I mean, we've just taken the artists everywhere. So always evolve. Always evolve. Always look for the just push forward. Don't sort of rest in the laurels. Yeah. Well, yeah, this is just easy. I'm just going to do it because. It's like, you know, the pool move my cheese, you know? Yeah, yeah. All yeah, of that. Yeah, yeah. So keep moving, moving yeah. and keep on and moving. Get, and getting excited by what you do. Wake up in the morning excited. Like, yeah. you know, like, hey, what's next? You know, not, oh God. <laughs> Gotta do it again. You know, that kind of thing. Is there a number four? Is there a number four? I'm sure there is, but yeah. I'm just the green tea, so <laughs> like getting on. Should have been like, a whiskey, right? <laughs> no, there are definitely there's definitely more. But anyway, let's yeah. Yeah. For, for, so, for now, I so, think so, if things. you had to live your life all over again, would you do anything different? Would you do anything different in terms of the gallery? I, no, I don't think I would. Yeah. Because I think you know, I think you just have to. Um, I, I, 
it's been a very interesting journey. I can't no deny question. that. I cannot it deny been, that. It must be so creatively fulfilling it, for you. Completely. And also it's been a huge learning curve. There have been challenges, there have been pit holes along the way. I've been disappointed by people. I've been shortchanged. I've been, you know, but at the same time, I've been inspired. I've met so many amazing people. You know, a lot of my close friends are people who started off because of my gallery. Through the gallery, I've met all these really interesting individuals from across from around so, so around your buddies are mainly the, are the art the creators themselves or the investors oh themselves? everyone everybody yeah. it's just incredible it's I mean like we've a had a around. network of friends around the world through the art world through my through the running this this gallery it's just it's been incredible you know um, oh fourth, fourth fourth piece of advice just came to my mind is um, if you want to do something which no one is when go somewhere if you want to go somewhere where no one has ever gone yeah Right. If you have enough, sort of like, um, what is it called? Belief. Belief. Just go for it. Yeah. It doesn't work out. It doesn't matter. But at least you tried. Yeah. You know what I mean. And the worst answer you can ever get. I keep and I always say this. And this is actually came from my god brother Han. I don't know if you know Han. Um, Solo. He said, <laughs> "Can be if you like." <laughs> um, was. Don't be afraid to ask. Don't be afraid to ask. The worst yeah. answer you can get is a no. Or just don't be afraid. Period. Yeah. Just do it. Be fearless. Yeah.